key Republican at the state capitol in Phoenix has concerns about the border security initiative the GOP wants to put on the November ballot. The state Senate adjourned for the day without voting on the measure that would empower local police to enforce federal immigration laws. 13 News reporter Bud Foster is tracking this debate. Bud, who's the holdout? Well, Brooke, he is Ken Bennett, a Republican from District 1, that's in Yavapai County. And if his name sounds familiar, it's because he's a former Secretary of State, ran for governor a few years ago, and he says he has some serious concerns about the Secure Borders Act, and the Republicans cannot afford to lose one vote in order to pass legislation, and it appears at this point they have lost Bennett. Now, just a little bit of background about uh, HCR, uh, House Concurrent Resolution 2060, it will allow local police to arrest someone they suspect is in the country illegally and will allow states to deport them uh, and not even to their country of origin. And that is one of Bennett's concerns. Another is racial profiling, like the Show Me Your Papers bill passed 14 years ago, SB 1070. This one has caused concerns that police will stop brown skinned people without probable cause. Bennett has some concerns about that, although he says he is a strong supporter of law enforcement. It will also, another concern, is it's, uh, the huge cost estimates to implement and enforce could be hundreds of millions of dollars. And another, the bill could target DACA recipients, and that's another concern for the Republican lawmaker. Well, if you don't get what you want on that, are you still going to vote for it? Uh, there are some things that if we don't get, I won't vote for it. But okay, what are those things? We need to wrap it up because what we have things? a meeting oh. right now, Senator. Yeah. Yeah. What, <laughs> are those, what are those what things? What time are they no, supposed I'm not, to come I'm back? I'm not going to get into the details get of um, what's a, a go or no-go, but some of these things are important enough that um, my vote is contingent on it. Now, even if Bennett supported the bill today, there wouldn't have been a vote. Tucson Republican Justine Wanstack was absent, so they didn't have enough votes to pass it. Like I said, they can't lose a single vote to pass legislation, so they adjourned for eight days. So even if they make changes that will pacify Bennett and Wanstack comes back, the bill, if it gets through the Senate, must also pass through the House if it's uh, going to show up on the ballot in November, and right now there's no guarantee of that. I'm Bud Foster, 13 News.